Okay. So, and I'm going to try to do this from behind. So if it's not perfectly straight or something, it's more of a demonstration for you guys. I don't usually do my pull-ups from behind the dog. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to grab some hair and I'm not going back like all the way to the crown. I'm getting the hair that's going to hang in the dog's eyes. And this way I can leave it a little bit looser. Okay. So the first way we're going to do this. Get your head up, Prissy. Alrighty. Get a rubber band here. And I'm going to pull this up, but I'm not going to tighten the band extremely tight. Uh, just a couple loops here. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at her <laughs> and see if it's remotely straight. Yeah, there we go. And I, like I said, I want this loose enough where it'll move a little bit. Then we take our nifty little tool. It's got a point on one end and it's got a loop on the other. Okay. And I'm going to run it through the center of this. Once I get it through the center, I'm going to take my fingers and pull this hair through the loop. Okay. And then what you're going to do is pull it through. I think in little girls, they used to call these like a topsy something, not the topsy turvy. That's a tomato plant hanger, but something to that effect. And then I'm just going to kind of tighten down. It gives you this neat little loop here. 